Hello everyone, Shandrea here with a look at the Baskin Robbins flavor of the month. It's, it's chicken and waffles. I saw the ad like a, maybe a week or two ago and I posted it on my page. And so I was like, okay, this has to be my next Tasty Tuesday. So I went down to Baskin Robbins, talked to the lady on the inside. And basically I will say this, it's selling. It's selling. But she said, you really have to like maple flavor to really like this ice cream. So I got my scoop. I had to rush home before it melted. And I threw it in the freezer while I got ready for this video. But um, this is, can you even see that? You can't even see. I took a picture of it, though. You can check out that picture. Um, it was about four bucks, four fifty or something like that for one scoop. Remember that. So let me tell you what the release says about this ice cream. It says, at Baskin Robbins, we pride ourselves on bringing innovative flavors to market, which is why we saw the growing popularity of chicken and waffles on menus. We knew we had to create a bold flavor that would change the way our guests enjoy chicken and waffles said Hannah Suits, Director of Brand Marketing for Baskin Robbins. And it goes on to say, this flavor is a frozen twist on the iconic brunch dish recreated in a deliciously deconstructed concept that is unique to our shops. And that's another thing I want to talk about with this, right? With this particular item. So when you see the ad, you see like a scoop of ice cream on top of a waffle, right? You don't get a waffle with that. All you get is a scoop. No waffle. You might get a waffle cone if you ask them for one and pay the extra, but there is no waffle with this. My first impression of this is, um, I know you can't really see it because of my camera lighting or whatever, but um, it's it's ice creamy. It's very soft, um, super duper soft. Uh, the, the smell is very much um, a strong maple smell. And so um, the lady, she's like, hey, you're either going to love it or you're going to hate it. So here goes nothing. The chicken and waffles ice cream. I know it's supposed to have little bits of, let me see what's supposed to be in it. Little bits of a uh, waffle. Okay. The flavor features buttermilk waffle flavored ice cream with plenty of crispy chicken and waffle flavored bites drizzled in a decadent bourbon maple syrup flavored swirl. Of course, there's no real chicken in this. So I'm guessing they're trying, they're trying to capture the essence of the chicken. So let's see what's going on with this. And I know it's very super, it's gotta be sweet and super calories in it and all that stuff. Okay. So here's what it kind of looks like, whatever color you can see there. Here we go. Okay. Okay. So I like it. It's very sweet, but here's the thing. It has like, some little crunchy pieces in it. I guess it's waffle pieces or whatever you want to say. Just as far as like tasting the the little bits that are inside of there, like the little, I'm calling it little mini biscuit pieces because they're kind of buttery and salty tasting. Um, that's what you get, crunchy, salty, buttery tasting. Um, as far as like buttermilk, I mean, I guess that's what you get. I mean, it's made out of milk, so it's what you're getting. But the maple flavor is really strong. The maple scent is very strong. I don't really get chicken out of this at all. I just get a savory, slightly salty taste with the um, with the little pieces that are inside of it. But hmm, I don't really. I've never had bourbon, so I don't really know what that taste is. But I just I just taste a whole lot of maple. I don't get any chicken out of this whatsoever. I do get like a pancake type of flavor because of the maple maybe that's inside of it there's like a ton of maple with this another thing to think about too is when you buy this you have to eat it like immediately you can't really wait on it and it is only available to the end of the month from what i understand so four dollars and fifty cents to get it chicken and waffles ice cream is actually worth a try i mean it's not something i would go order again because it's super sweet and i'm sure the calories are like ridiculous on this thing but i'm finishing it later